it's your girl K. Welcome to, welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title, today I'm going to be doing an early look on the Air Jordan Virtual One Hot OG University Blue. So let's get straight into the video. So if you are an OG and you watch my shoe videos, you know I always give y'all the details before I do the close up. So these shoes are set to release July 22nd, 2023, this upcoming Saturday. And the set retail price for men's sizes are $180 USD. Now they had did a shock drop for this shoe July 6th, and that's when my father got his. Around that time on StockX, they were going for about $300, but now they're going for about $213. So it shouldn't be, you know, too difficult to cop you a pair on release day. And lastly, once I do a close-up, you guys will be able to see how much this shoe resembles the style of the Air Jordan Retro 1 High OG Obsidian that released in August of 2019. And that's pretty much all of the details that I wanted to give to you guys, so let's get into the close-up. So the major difference between our University Jordan 1 and our Obsidian UNC Jordan 1 is that instead of Obsidian Blue, we have just black. But if we look at our toe box, you can see that beautiful university blue leather. It's tumbled along with our perforations. And around that, we have our nice, smooth black leather. If we go to the side of the shoe, you can see our beautiful, nice, clean, white midsoles. We also have some white, smooth leather here. But you can see we have a somewhat tumbled black Nike check along with this black leather that goes up to where our shoestrings are and then we have this nice university blue again this university blue is so beautiful like it reminds me of my patent UNC's the women's versions it's just too cute and then we have our Jordan Wings logo in a matte finish and then our upper material is black smooth leather. This is what the back looks like. Then if we turn to the side, looks the exact same. Yeah, this shoe is super cute. Like, I like this. I will wear this. <laughs> then if you look at the bottom, y'all, I'm loving, like, I'm loving this blue. It looks so good. We have our Nike and then a Nike swoosh along with our pod. And then if we look at the tongue, we have Nike Air with our swoosh. And then the inside, oh, we have our laces, our black laces. And then on the inside, we have Nike Air with the swoosh. I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can really see it. And then I know y'all see that 11 and a half. So y'all know that this is not my personal pair. This is actually my dad's. But I wanted to get this video out for you guys. And then we just have our regular paper. And then the sizing sticker right here. Now for the box, I am so happy that majority of the box is this blue color. Like... Oh, look, it's just such a beauty. So we have Nike and then the swoosh. Same thing on this side. Same thing on this side. It says 1985 Air Jordan 1. And we have Nike swoosh on this side. And then we have the sizing sticker. So to the left of our sticker, we have the barcode. Then it says Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG. And then it says USA size 11 and a half. So y'all know it's not my personal pet, even though I wish it was so I could do it on foot. And then we have our QR code. And then the bottom, it's just the regular plain bottom. And the inside, we have our white paper. And that's pretty much it. So like I said earlier in this video, this shoe should not really be that difficult to cop on release day. And if it is, you can always just go on StockX. Now, they might go up 
after they sell because i mean most jordans do but like i said as of right now they're going for about 213 for a size 11 and a half according to StockX. but that's it thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed make sure you like this video subscribe to become a part of the k fan also comment down below let your girl know is this a cop or drop and if you cop them are you going to wear them or resell them for that resale price me personally i'm aware of them but that's up to y'all. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Bye!